Um, I want to start by uh, inviting our dear um, partner in uh, crime here, Herman, CEO of Cyberport. Herman, please. Thanks a lot. Um, uh, Councillor Yasha, speakers, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, good morning and welcome to Cyberport. It is my pleasure to welcome you for joining us today for the first international research conference on venture. Asia tech and innovation scenes are booming. Other than the powerhouse such as, uh, of course, Israel, China, and Silicon Valley, where headlines and record deals are frequently made, Asia has also been making significant headway over the past few years. Tech and innovation are quickly transforming societies and economies in the region. And disruption is becoming a commonplace. In Hong Kong, the growth in tech and, inno and innovation sector has also been robust. We've seen a 46% surge in the startups over the past year, according to the figure from Invest Hong Kong. We are attracting talents from both from local and overseas. Our startups are transforming industries, creating new markets, and expanding globally. Many of them are right here with us at Cyberport. Close to 600 startups have joined various Cyberport programs, including seed funding, incubation, co-working spaces, just to name a few. Industry interest is also growing very quickly. To give you an example, the number of industry players involved in the Cyberport's regional and international network is growing rapidly. This offers us opportunity we have never seen before, allowing us more ways to help our startups living on their global ambitions. Support for startup is also uh, thriving in Hong Kong. Co-working spaces, large corporations, academic uh, institutions, incubator, accelerator, and the government are all stepping up the support for startups. And they are offering not only funding, but also capacity and business building opportunities. In the, in the next few hours, we are going to look at the future of venture from various perspectives historical, geographical, policy making, and many more. We have speakers from both industry and academia. Uh, they are ex the experts in tech management, research, startup uh, advisory, finance, innovative solutions, capital makers, and, and think tanks. And they will share with us the latest development and the best practices in venture investments and talk about many new ideas and models. And I would like to take this opportunity to thank the Kola Institute of Venture of the Tel Aviv University for bringing the CIV to Hong Kong. I had the privilege to join as a member of the delegation organized by the Chancellor himself last month to visit Israel. Uh, Israel. Uh, the delegation was led by the Chief Executive of Hong Kong. One of the very important stops, of course, was the Tel Aviv University, and we had the opportunity we had the honor to meet with the Tel Aviv president, Professor Kleifter. Now, first of all, during the meeting, the name of Yesha was mentioned many, many times. <laughs> he, he said his relationship with Hong Kong was, uh, was uh, very strongly proved during that meeting. Um, and then secondly, when trying to prove the strong relationship and collaboration between the two economies, Professor Kleifter actually pulled out a piece of paper as a proof. And the paper he pulled out was this paper. <laughs> And, uh, and for some of you who cannot see this, this is a leaflet of uh, this particular conference. So I'm sure the expectation from the president of Te uh, Tel Aviv University and the chief executive of Hong Kong on this conference is very high, so we have to work hard to live up to that expectation. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I wish you a very successful and fruitful event today, and thank, th thank you very much for joining us. Thanks. Thank you very much to Herman. Uh, when we, about a year ago, pondered, uh, and I talked to Ellie about hosting a conference in uh, Hong Kong, and Ellie said, fine, this is a great idea, but we need a strong partner. So we um, put in a call, and you know, for all those people in Hong Kong, there are all kinds of players in the field, and we send them out to all the people and said, who wants to be our partner? And the number one company, organization that came in place, Noah did a whole matrix of comparing things and said there's no doubt Cyberport is the partner. And I must say that Cyberport has exceeded 
our own expectations are usually very high in terms of flexibility, adaptability, and actually organizing. So thank you again. And I will use many opportunities to thank you. Thank you very much.